name is Elaine Krebs and I am a Polar Trek educator for the 2020-2021 season. I'm here to talk about a silver lining as a result of the COVID-19 pandemic. Sheltering in place and reducing travel are great ways to help stop the spread of the virus, but they also may be helping Mother Nature. NASA and the European Space Agency have released satellite images showing that nitrous oxide levels over Italy, China, and most of Europe have reduced to almost zero as a result of reduced travel, decreased industrial production, and also no flying, all major sources of air pollution. Right here in Los Angeles, our air quality levels have been green or healthy for almost three weeks now. Just a month ago, our air quality levels were labeled unhealthy by the EPA, and the American Lung Association cited Los Angeles as the smoggiest city in the country. Will these changes last? I don't know. But scientists studying Antarctic ice cores have noted that global events such as wars or pandemics like this one have had an effect on lowering carbon dioxide levels in the atmosphere. Maybe COVID-19 will have the same impact. What I do hope is that we develop sustainable practices we can continue after the pandemic. Things like walking or biking as methods of travel, limiting our trips to the store every time we need something, or even using less toilet paper. So next time you're feeling sad or frustrated that you have to stay at home, think about how you're not just helping slow the spread of the virus, you're also giving our Earth a little break too.